we are looking at the z score the z score and something known as the t score so these both are for the osteoporosis so to begin with we are going to ask some questions the first question being in case of the osteopenia so in terms of the osteopenia what is the t score the second question will be in terms of the normal t score so in terms of the normal t score what is the per normal range of the t score so in this video we'll find the answers to this and learn in detail so first we'll be beginning with the z score so the z score it is the nothing but the number of the standard deviation it is the a standard deviation of a patient's bmd deviation of the patient's bmd bmd stands for the bone mass density the bone mass density so basically this differs from the average bmd it differs it differs from the average bmd and it differs uh, in basis of their age, sex, as well as the ethnicity. So the Z score, if you see, this is of two. If you see the Z score of two or below or below. So this basically triggers the investigation for the underlying disease. So it triggers the investigation for the underlying disease next comes something known as the t score so what is the t score t score basically it is the a bmd at the site of bmd is basically stands for the bone mass density at the site when compared to the young normal reference man when compared to the young normal reference man Whereas the z-score was based on the age, sex and ethnicity. So the referral man, uh, it is the reference mean. It is a comparison of the patient's BMD to that of the healthy 30 year olds. So it is comparison of the patient's BMD to that of a 30 year old healthy person. Now uh, looking at the classifications of the t-scores. So as we know the t-score it can be normal so in terms of normal it is nothing but it is called minus one or higher or higher is known as a normal next if you see osteopenia what is osteopenia so in case of osteopenia it is defined as a t-score it is defined as a t-score it is between the minus one to minus 2.5 next we move on to the osteoporosis osteoporosis so in terms of osteoporosis is defined as the t score of 2.5 or lower so in case the t score is 2.5 or lower it is osteoporosis so here the bmd which has a two and a half standard deviations it has two and a half standard deviations below the mean so it has 2.5 standard deviation below mean below mean of a 30 year old man or woman so this was above the, the t score as well now we'll be answering our question so we had asked two questions the first question being what is in case of osteopenia what is a t score so in terms of osteopenia is defined as a t score it goes between minus 1 to 2 minus 2.5 this is nothing but the t score Next, we look at the second one that is a normal. So, normal T score is nothing but the T score of minus 1 or higher. So, it can be a T score of minus 1 or higher.